name's Kieran Proctor, I'm 17 years old and I'm an attacker. Okay, so um, so obviously you haven't been at a dive for too long, just on track. How have you found your time here so far? Really different because I was at Cardiff City beforehand and they're a Cat 2 club, whereas Derby are a Cat 1 club, so the training is more intense. The hours you put in and everything around, like the facilities, are completely different. It's just a lot better. Are you enjoying it because of the step up? Yeah, definitely. Because I got released from Cardiff as well. I didn't expect to come straight to a, a club like Derby. So coming from a Cat 2 club again to a Cat 1 club is just a massive step up. And obviously you talk about life in uh, Cardiff, what is, your, is, is that where you sort of started your football career or has there been other clubs? Yeah, because I was at Cardiff since I was six years old, so I was there all my life. And I got released at 17, so like mid to second year scholar. So I've come, come here, for like my first trial was Derby, I went to Sunderland and I've come back here. And how have you, obviously you touched about the facilities, but not only that, but you've got coaches like Rory Dallant and Justin Walker who have got a wealth of experience. How have you found that settling in? Really good. It's been really good them coaching us as well because I've never, apart from Craig Bellamy, Craig Bellamy's the only big coach I've had. So coming in and having these coaches as well is really nice because obviously they've experienced the game. How did you find um, being coached by Craig Bellamy? Different. He coaches different ways, but... He's a good coach at the same time. He knows how he wants his players to play. But he can be a bit strict at times, but that's what's needed in young players. And as, it, as an attacker yourself, did you feel like you learned particularly off him because of his experience? When I was when he was taking training sessions and drills, he'd do specific things for attackers and he'd mainly work with attackers. So going forward with Cardiff we were unbelievable. But defending on the other hand it was slightly different because we didn't work on it as much. And obviously you, you, you weren't here during the, the victory that over Manchester United earlier in the season. Uh, how sort of, how much have the players sort of been trying to tell you about that experience and how excited are you to get that possibly get the opportunity to play tomorrow? I'm excited to play against Man United because obviously I've never really played against a big team like our Premier League teams. But they haven't really I haven't really been with the boys that long, so I haven't really spoke to them about who they've played and how they've got on, just trying to focus on tomorrow's game. And obviously, like you said, you've been at Cardiff for such a long time. How much, uh, obviously at this point of leaving Cardiff, you know, somewhere where you've been all your life, how much of a mental, uh, you know, sort of mental strength will that give you, do you think, if you do manage to make it into the game, having dealt with such a, such a blow? It was difficult at the time, but then I thought it was better for me as well, because I'd been there all my life and needed a change. So when I come to here, I felt all the stress was relieved off my shoulders. I could just have a fresh start somewhere and enjoy football again. And uh, how, was your, how have you found obviously moving into a new area? Because obviously a young lad like yourself can't have been uh, that easy to move from Cardiff to, to around this sort of area. I want to because I'm in digs with two of the other boys, Jaden Lawson and Jaden Bogle. So they've helped me settle in really well. And the boys especially, they've helped me so much. So, and they've made me feel really welcome to the club. And uh, how do you feel the support network here is at Derby compared to possibly your old club like Cardiff? Do you say obviously not only do they touch on the actual coaching side and the on the pitch things, but sort of like the header education and uh, you know the sort of all package that is coming to Derby under 18? Well, they were they sorted it all out for me for the extra four weeks, but I had to finish my education with Cardiff. <coughs> so I'm really been doing education with Derby. So. I had, to I had to go back to Cardiff to finish that. And what was the uh, what was the draw to come back here? Because obviously, like you touched on, you said you did have a brief uh, brief spell at Sunderland. Uh, what was it that drew you to come back to Derby? Uh, when I was at Derby for a week, they come they were interested first, and then I went to Sunderland for a couple of days. And Derby, when I played my first game for Derby, they got in contact with my agent and said they wanted me back for four weeks, which was from yesterday. So I drove back up yesterday, and I start my four weeks now. Yeah, that's brilliant. Yeah, yeah, that's brilliant.